welcome back to my channel. So I thought I would do a line progression test for you guys from 9 DPO all the way to 19 DPO when I stopped testing. So I did use first response test as you can see. Some have the pink cap and some have the clear cap. Not sure if there's a difference, but I've never seen the pink cap until this pregnancy, which is my eighth pregnancy, but will be my seventh living baby if everything goes well. So I did have an early miscarriage, and then two weeks later, I did get pregnant with my now three-year-old, who is my youngest of six. So this is my 9 DPO test, 10 DPO test, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, AM and PM, 16 AM and PM, 17 AM and PM, 18 AM, 19 AM when I stopped testing. So I just wanna let you guys know if your lines get a little faint, don't be discouraged. I know I was, I was very worried since I did have an early miscarriage in the past. And when that happened, I knew what it meant right away that my HCG was dropping and I was losing the baby, which is devastating. And my heart goes out to anybody who has ever experienced that. It's very, very heart wrenching. And I'm not gonna lie, I was preparing myself for another early miscarriage, but I did continue to test and my lines came back darker. I do drink a lot of water, so that may have affected 15 DPO. I'm not sure exactly what could have caused the test to be lighter, but don't be discouraged if your lines get a little lighter. Just keep testing and see if they progress and how they progress. So I typically test during my pregnancies until I get my dye stealer, which I did at 17 DPO. Sorry guys, I'm so out of breath. Um, that always happens during my pregnancies. I get so out of breath. So 17, 18, and 19 DPO were my dye stealers. And again, that's my nine DPO. All the way to 19 DPO. But I'm not gonna show my face in this video because I am decluttering and cleaning and organizing my house, especially all the kids' toys. But I did wanna make this quick video for you guys because I know when my lines got darker on 15 DPO, I did binge watch so many YouTube videos, online progression, pregnancy test videos, and I think that a lot of people find them useful. And maybe this will give you a little bit of hope. If your lines get a little lighter, just like I said, test the next day, see if they get darker and see how they progress. If that happens to you because I was panicking and now I am finally relieved that my lines are darker and I got my dye stealers. So typically when I get my dye stealers, I quit testing. I've not made a doctor's appointment yet. They want you to wait till you're eight weeks pregnant to make your doctor appointment. So that is what I'm going to do. I'm five weeks and two days today. And super out of breath and super thirsty. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to end this video, but I hope you all found this helpful. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new, which I'm sure you are. I just started this YouTube channel, so I think this might be my like third or fourth video. If you would like to follow along with me, my seventh pregnancy journey, make sure to subscribe and turn the notification bell on. And I will see you guys on my next video. Bye, guys.